Welcome to the Invite Health Podcast, where our degreed healthcare professionals are excited to offer you the most important health and wellness information you need to make informed choices about your health. You can learn more about the products discussed in each of these episodes and all that Invite Health has to offer at www.invitehealth.com slash podcast. First time customers can use promo code podcast at checkout for an additional 15% off your first purchase. Let's get started. I remember about 10 years ago being completely astonished to learn that they estimate that 80 million Americans have arthritis. Now this is doctor diagnosed arthritis. They have now just come out and said that they believe that number to be well over 90 million. So 92 million is of the most recent assessment of those who have doctor diagnosed arthritis. And what's the difference between doctor diagnosed arthritis and arthritis? Well, one is you went to your doctor, you told them, hey, my knee always hurts, or hey, my hip always hurts. And they write down that you have most likely osteoarthritis. On the other hand, we have people who deal with joint pain on a regular basis where maybe you've never told your doctor about it or maybe you don't see your doctor on a regular basis. So we know that if we've got 92 million Americans with doctor diagnosed arthritis, we certainly have a very high number of people who have arthritis who have not been diagnosed. And when it comes to arthritis, the main problem that most people will complain about is the pain. So I want to talk in some detail today about one of our most tried and true formulations that we offer at Invite Health that has brought such success to so many people who deal with arthritic conditions, and that's our BioKirkman 5 Loxin formulation. I am Dr. Amanda Williams, Scientific Director at Invite Health, and when it comes to arthritis, there are so many different types. Most of the time we we zero in predominantly on rheumatoid arthritis, and then there's osteoarthritis. It was always thought that rheumatoid arthritis was the autoimmune variety, whereas osteoarthritis was solely due to wear and tear. We now recognize that's not necessarily the case. Both of them have an underlying immune component to it that drives this heightened state of inflammation. Certainly with the level of autoimmune involvement in RA, this is where you see more of the permanent joint um, destruction or changes that occur. And this is why we always need to be on top of inflammation and degradation that is occurring within the joints themselves. So um, some people have heard of, you know, juvenile onset arthritis, um, juvenile fibromyalgia exists now, gout, um, gouty arthritis, where the underlying uric acid crystals are also a driving component. There is psoriatic arthritis, um, many different ways to which arthritis can show itself. Um, Sjogren syndrome, scleroderma, lupus certainly has arthritic undertones to it. So what we know is that it's very common that many Americans are dealing with chronic daily inflammation and chronic pain, which can impact your ability to do daily activities and make it very difficult to, you know, just to even walk or for, you know, to go up and down stairs. And of course, this can lead to to permanent um, disabilities. So it's something that we do always want to address. Now, what we know is that through the use of these two nutrients that we have in our biocurcumin 5 loxin formulation, these have both been studied independently to be shown to be highly effective at targeting and easing inflammation and discomfort within the joints, which is why people continue to come back and utilize these formulations from us. So the the curcumin that we use is known as BCM95. That's a registered trademark form that has been used in human clinical trials targeting things such as rheumatoid as well as osteoarthritis. And then the 5-loxin is a registered trademark form of boswellia extract, also been shown to be highly effective in targeting inflammation 
with arthritic conditions. So we can now start to expand out and see the many other benefits that go along with the use of curcumin and boswellia. So if folks come to us and they have concerns outside of joint health, maybe they have concerns with blood sugar regulation or respiratory health or GI health, we oftentimes will advise the biocurcumin 5 and formulation for all of those systemic benefits that we know that the curcumin and boswellia extract can yield. Now, curcumin itself, that is the, the powerful constituents that are found deep inside of the turmeric root itself and certainly has been shown to be very beneficial not only for inflammatory disorders but also for fighting off oxidative stress and in the foods journal back in 2017 they really kind of went through and broke this down how turmeric the spice that most people think about when you look at the the rhizomes the the curcuminoids that are derived from that this very powerful polyphenol, how this has actually been shown and proven to target multiple signaling molecules, such as the COX-1 and the COX-2 and the LOX pathway. So those are all pathways that release different cytokines or leukotrienes that can drive up inflammation. Hence, this is why its mechanism of action can be zeroed in on as an antioxidant but also as an anti-inflammatory, as they describe, hence why it's beneficial when it comes to arthritis, because we know that oxidative stress and inflammation is kind of the, the backbone to arthritis itself. And looking at conditions outside of that, such as metabolic syndrome, for example, and with the regulation of healthy cholesterol transport, we can see the impact that the curcumin itself can actually have. And what's really nice is for those who are quote unquote healthy, we can see that the utilization of curcumin has actually been shown to be beneficial when it comes to brain health and for um, fighting off a lot of the, the unfortunate, um, just due to the environments that we live in, a lot of that oxidative stress and the free radical damage that can occur throughout the body. So it's not just a formulation for someone who is actually having these um, symptoms, but certainly we can see through the Journal of Medicinal Foods Journal how the efficacy of curcumin extract when it comes to alleviating the pain and inflammation within the joints, it's really quite powerful. But remember, not all curcumin is created the same. And the form that we use, this BCM95, has been shown to be upwards of seven times more bioavailable, meaning it's easier for it to make its way into our bloodstream, making it through the digestive process, not being broken down, where a lot of that curcumin and the power of that curcumin is lost. So the bioavailability of the BCM95 is really quite high. And because of that ability to make it into the bloodstream, this is why it is so incredibly effective. And this is why we use this form in our particular formulation. So looking at all of the, the many different clinical research trials that have zeroed in on the therapeutic efficacy of the utilization of curcumin in the setting of arthritis, we can certainly see why it is that this particular product remains one of our top performers because it is so beneficial. Now we can also see the same thing being said true when we look at the five locks in formulation, the effectiveness of Boswellia extract on osteoarthritis. In the British Medical Journal, they talk about this by going through and analyzing a review or a meta-analysis, one would say, of different clinical trials that have looked at the use of Boswellia extract for the treatment of osteoarthritis. They were able to see how Boswellia mimicked the same actions that curcumin does in terms of not being um, only a powerful antioxidant, but also in terms of having anti-inflammatory properties to it and hence being so beneficial for those who were suffering with arthritis. So not only the inflammation, but also the pain that was associated with this. And they said that Boswellia extract 
can be looked at as an effective and safe treatment for patients who have osteoarthritis. Through many of the studies that they looked at with the Boswellia extract, they were seeing these benefits within the first two to four weeks. And I think that that um, speaks volume as to the power of these different herbal extracts, which is why we have such success with it because people who come to us that are experiencing a lot of pain or discomfort because of the inflammation occurring within their joints, they just want that to go away. And to to see the effectiveness of Boswellia extract when it comes to osteoarthritis, to see that combination utilizing the BCM95 curcumin that's highly absorbable, meaning it's getting into that bloodstream. This is what makes this formulation so incredibly helpful. Now, people often ask me, well, how many per day should I take? And I always say, if you come to us and you're acute and you're like, oh my goodness, I'm in so much um, pain, then I would say using two caps twice a day for two weeks. I always go by that rule of two. So two caps in the morning with breakfast, two caps with dinner, do that for two weeks. At that point, and generally speaking, most people will see that difference within the first two to three days. Um, but at that point, you don't want to just back off because we don't want that inflammation to to come back. We want to be able to really help regulate those pathways. So that's why we do that for two weeks. At that point, then we can reassess and say, okay, maybe now using two caps per day total, one in the morning with breakfast, one at dinner, just to maintain. For some people, they'll find that just taking one per day thereafter is sufficient. So you always want to work with one of the invite health nutritionists to to really have a personalized plan for how you utilize the biocurcumin 5 locks. And remember, it's wonderful for many other functions as well when it comes to GI support, brain health support, blood sugar support, cholesterol management. So there are different protocols for the use of the biocurcumin 5 locks and formulation. So just don't be shy or bashful. Make sure that you ask how you should use that formulation based on your specific needs. But when it comes to easing inflammation and targeting that discomfort, this is our go-to formulation. So check it out, Biocurcumin 5 Loxin. And I want to thank you so much for tuning in to the Invite Health Podcast. Remember, you can find all of our episodes for free wherever you listen to podcasts or by visiting invitehealth.com slash podcast. Do make sure that you subscribe and you leave us a review. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Invite Health. And we will see you next time for another episode of the Invite Health Podcast. 